Ladies and oh shoot, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. Oh man, I just hurt my leg. Oh my lord, ladies and gentlemen, I am here on the CD show. Oh, let me fix this real fast. <sighs> ladies and gentlemen, I am here on the CD show tonight. Um, and like I said tonight, I am going to do a um a World Series um game one. Um, you know what happened? What I thought would happen. And game one of the World Series. Um, so I made my re excuse me. I made my pre. I made my my um my preview um, on Saturday night. And tonight, um, a lot of you. Well, I mean, you guys. Um, I told you guys tonight that I was gonna make a. I don't know if I'm gonna make this for the, for the whole series. Probably not. There's some other stuff I want to talk about. But for tonight, in the first game. I'm gonna give you what I thought, what what my thoughts were on the first game of the 2017 World Series. All right, let's look at this thing. First game. By the way, okay, let, 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 let's talk. Let's talk here. K Clay Kershaw versus Keiko. One of the things going into this game was gonna be what the weather. It was a. It was. It felt. It, it, it felt like it was the summer. Very um, warm game for World Series. And that would be a problem for the Astros because they're used to pay, playing in, inside. So they wonder, especially for Tycho, would the humidity affect them? Um, I don't think it really did. I think more than anything, it, you know, he had to settle in. First, one, first bat comes up, leadoff home run. I'm like, oh, no, Tycho's going to fall flat on his face. Because, you know, he's known for... On his, in, 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 um, in his hat in, in Houston, he pitches pretty good. But away from away for away, he he, um, he he does not good. We saw what happened in, in the series versus the Yankees. He pitched that wonderful game in in um um in his uh, um in Houston, and then what happened when he went to Yankee Stadium? He fell flat on his face. And tonight I wonder, first pitch leadoff home run. I'm like, this man fell the ball flat on his face again. But no, I thought he did a nice job of settling in there. But then late in the game, um, he gave up uh, another home run to Turner. That guy can, you know, he can just hit. Come on, top. I think he let the lead. I excuse me, I he was in top five in the league in hitting. That guy can hit. He got that Manny Ramirez swing. You know, shout out to Turner. I used to make fun of him that he looked like a chick from Wendy's. But I mean, at least now he's got the beer, so he looks a little bit more manly. But anyways, um, Turner hits a home run, three one. Um, and they win the game. Alex Alex Berman, the third baseman for Houston, had a home run, a solo home run. Um, Kershaw was he pitched pretty good. Eleven strikeouts, no walks. This guy pitches behind off. He this this guy used to be a guy like you know Peyton, the Peyton Manning of 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 of, of, um, of uh, Major League Baseball, where he would. How have a very good season, and then in the playoffs, all center of his face. But last year and this year, he has figured it out. I don't know what has happened, but he is starting to perform. Um, in the play, the way he did in the season, he is starting to perform in the playoffs. Last year, unbelievable, almost literally won the. You know, I think that one series, I, um, with um, what, what was it? What, Washington last year, he almost won. He won by himself. If you ask me, I think he pitched three times. Same thing in the NLCS last year with Chicago, you know. But um, what the problem was, they did not have any other pitch, especially in the bullpen. It was basically Kershaw and Jansen, the closer. Now you bring in some other guys. Now you bring you Darvish. And then you bring in, um, you know, um, Morrow along to help Jansen in the bullpen. You have brought in, you, you, you know, those two guys especially, you know, Ma, um, Darvich and Morrow. Darvich to help out and be that number two guy um, in the, uh, after Kershaw and Morrow to be that guy to set up the closer Jansen. And I think that's been that's really different. You look at this team and they find that's what they needed. They needed somebody to set up, you know, have the starting pitcher go seven innings. That's what Kershaw did tonight. Seven innings, one run, 11 strikeouts, no walks. Then you give it to Morrow. Morrow, you know, shuts down and then Jansen comes in, shuts down. That is what you want. That is how you win. Um, that is how you win. You have the, the the starter go seven innings, give up one, two, three runs, and then you bring in uh, the setup man and the closer. That is the way. That is probably the most simple way to win a game. You know, pitching, pitching, pitching. 
That's how you're going to win. That is how you're going to win. Now, I thought, like I said before, I thought the Indians and the Yankees have the better pitching overall. They are both sitting at home right now. But if, if you look at the National League, the LA, or Los Angeles probably has the best pitching out of everybody. Out of everybody who made it to the playoffs this year in the, in the National League side, they probably have the best pitching left. And so, I mean, Houston's got to get their, they, they got to, I think they need to win tomorrow night. They need to win tomorrow night. They got, it's going to be Rich Hill versus um, Justin Berlander. Houston has got to win that game tomorrow. I, I feel like, I think they're, I think Los Angeles is a better team. If you ask me, I think they really are. And I think tomorrow's the game you have to win if you're Houston. If you don't win tomorrow, yes, you have three games at home, but I don't know. I mean, 2-0, you do not want to do that. Especially, okay, let me tell you something, ladies and gentlemen. For the comp, if you have Keiko and Verlander lose, what do you think that's going to do for the confidence of Houston going um, in the future? That is going to hurt them. They need to at least have Justin Verlander win it tomorrow for them. They need to Justin Verlander have it to win it for them. If if both Keiko and Justin Verlander lose, I'm sorry, this could be you might as well start celebrating because I'm sorry, Charlie Morton, please, Mark, um, uh, 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 Lance McCullers. I like Lance McCullers, but come on, if Keiko and and Verlander can't get it can't get it done. I'm sorry. It's over. Tomorrow, Justin Berlander has got to come through and tie this thing 1-1 and give them confidence. You cannot go down 2-0. Not because necessarily go down 2-0, but because who will go down 2-0? Your best two pitchers. That will affect you. So tomorrow, I am looking for Justin Berlander to, to come out and kind of did what, Ty, excuse me, what Kershaw did tonight. And I am looking for that offense to, um, you, you still got a kind of a similar, he has a similar pitcher, you know, but he doesn't throw as hard as Karsh, Kershaw does Hill, but, you know, he still got the whole, you know, kind of the same pitches, but like, oh, you know, you know, the, you know, he's got the same pitches, but he's not as talented, doesn't throw as fast as Kershaw, so it should be a little bit easier tomorrow night. Um, they need to get more runs up, they need to put the ball in play. 11 strikeouts tonight for Houston. You have got to make contact. Got to put the ball in play. You know, it, Houston right now is playing what one man less. Why? Because they don't have their designated hitter. They don't have it. And you got the pitcher, Keiko, going up there. Doesn't know where to shoot on his watch. You know, keeps fouling everything and then, you know, strikes out. I mean, they're one man under until they get a Houston. But still, there's no excuse. You still got plenty of talent in that lineup. May contact, may stuff happen. You know, you got to get it tomorrow night. I think Justin Verlander will come out and do his thing. And I would like to see that. I, I just need to see more contact at least. Get out of game. 11 strikeouts is too much. I let it go because it is the best pitcher in the world in Kershaw. But still, Houston, you're one of, I think you led the league in scoring this year. You need to put the ball in play. May contact, may contact. Houston often struggled in the Yankees series. They didn't really get going. I think, other, you know, for the most part, they struggled. That, that, towards the end of the series, they got going. The last two games. Now, tonight, I will not freak out. I, it is Kershaw, like I said, the best pitcher in the world, in the league. So I'll let it go tonight. But tomorrow, I want to see that offense that I saw in game seven. I need to see that again from Houston. If tomorrow, once again, they lose, it's over. Justin Verlander and Keiko and Verlander go down. I'm sorry. It's done. I'm sorry. It, you got your two guys and they can't get it. Nobody's going to get it. I'm sorry. Houston, go get it tomorrow. Make this a serious. Make it a serious. Come on, Houston. Put a, Tie this thing up tomorrow. I want to see a World Series like last year. Seven games. What a World Series. I... I have a feeling we're not going to see that. We're gonna see, this may be a short one. I don't know. I'm hoping tonight it was just Kershaw, and then tomorrow Houston can put the ball in play a lot more and make stuff happen. Something up. I, I don't want to see that again tomorrow. I have a feeling I won't. I feel like Los Angeles will win the, the World Series, 
But I, I, I think Houston gets it tomorrow. They have to. They have to. Um, anyways, um, shout out to everybody. Everybody, you know. Um, there's some people that want to get shut out. Um, um, Big Zero, I believe you want to get shut out. I don't know you, Big Zero, but you, uh, Marty told me you want to get shut out. Um, but if that other guy's name, on um, the same thing, there's a lot of things happen with the show. I don't know why. Hey, but you're welcome. You know, I, I don't care if you're a cowboy fans. Who cares? I love everybody. Well, you know, anyways, um, whatever, New England. Those are probably the two teams I hit the most in the, in the league. Um, the Cowboys in New England. And I welcome you guys. If you're a Cowboys New England fan, welcome. I don't care about the same sense. I like Drew Brees, so you guys are always welcome. The two teams that I hate the most are the Cowboys and New England. And I have no problem with them. I have no problem with it. I'm a friendly guy. I'm a fat-ass friendly guy. You guys all know. A fat-ass friendly. Um, okay. Um, who else do I need to... Oh, yes. Um, Ronald. Ronald, my friend. You and I, we need to have a conversation here on the C show tonight. Okay, so you asked me for the review, I mean, me, for the preview, the preview of, of the World Series. And I told you, um, that video was made Saturday night. And then you told me tonight, you're like, um, I was looking for a, 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 uh, a, like a pre, like a, like a pre-game, um, show. I got that too late, I'm sorry. I, I don't know if I can do that. Like I said, I want to like really follow the World Series. Just, it is the, like the last thing. Um, but I'm, tomorrow, like I said, I need to I need to respect it. I need to do the NFL picks tomorrow. I don't know what I can bring. I want to, fall, I want to like I said, um, treat the World Series a little bit more like, you know, like I treat the NFL, you know, do a post-game show. But you guys know NFL is king, and the, trust me, I love base, I love the major league baseball. But I don't want to get out of my routine. You know what I mean? Um, but if you guys want me to work, if you guys want me to work, be a workhorse. Put it in the comment section. If if five people tell me, five people tell me, I want to not a not a pregame. It's too. I I cannot do that. But a post game. I'm sorry, Ronald. Trust me. I hope tonight delivered. I hope I delivered. If five people comment down that they want a um a post show after every World Series game, I will bring it. If five people comment down below, hey, you fat ass P.E. I a fr friendly fat ass. Want five? I want five people. Um, I don't know, Ronald, Marty, um, Chicken Wings, um. Uh, Johnny, I don't know, um, Patterson, I know you're going to be on it because you're the Mr. Baseball up in here. If I keep a comment, hey, friendly, fat-ass CE, make, make post-game shows after every game in the World Series, I will come here, I will figure out something. If I have to do a, 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 a two shows and I, I don't care, hey, production, production, handle it. Anyways, um, I will do it. I will do it. You guys want me to bring it? I'll bring it. But I need to see it. Five people comment. Ronald, Marty, um, Johnny, Patter, um, Chicken Wings, Patterson, somebody. I don't know. I, I don't know if there's more fans. I don't know. Um, Big Zero, you watch my videos. I don't know if you're. I don't know if you have a, a way to comment. Don't be shy. Um, what is that other guy's name? Watermelon Weather. What else his name is? Marty, he's another friend of yours. I don't know. Comment. Five people comment, and I will bring it tomorrow night. And every night until the, for the next, when until the World Series is over, I will come on here, sign away, and do it. But I need to see the fans. I need to see the fans. I need to see you guys. Hey, fat ass friendly CE, do this for us, and I will do it. Anyways, I think the show's over. Tonight for, for tonight, I think I'm gonna say see you until next time. I will see you later. Um, tomorrow and yes. Um, okay. I I need to see what the support is tomorrow. Um, so I'm gonna be looking forward all day. You know, morning, night, whatever. And if if I by the time I get by the time the game's over, 11, 12. You know, I make my videos late. But if from right now until um to, tomorrow night, there's at least five people. I will make a preview, excuse me, a post show 
for every game of the World Series for the rest of this season. But you guys gotta, you guys gotta show me that you want this. Show me that you want it. Until next time, I am CE, the friendly fat ass. And until next time, I will see you later. And I will see. <coughs> I had some donuts tonight. Well, you, those of you guys who want to know what I ate tonight, I had some donuts. And I, what else did I have? Yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm a fat ass. Anyways, um, yeah, I saw soup, you know, the sea man, you know. We don't get fat, we stay fat. Anyways, um, I want to say everybody thank you for tonight's show. Until next time, I am CE, and I will see you later. And I will see you later. And I will see you later. I don't have a, I don't know, I, I, you guys probably don't even know what that song is. Anyways, um, what the hell? Wait, what is happening right now in the scene? 15 minutes of me knowing my role and shut, not shutting my mouth? Are you kidding me? This is why the CE show has low, I, 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 you, I hope you guys watch the whole show. Let me know in the comment section. Hey, CE, no, do screw that. Just put the, just put, don't, don't worry about that one. Just put everything you, like I said, five people and I'll do it. But right now, we need to close up the sites. I am still working on the other stuff I said. We are going to make this show professional, more professional. So stay in there. We are making the show professional. You guys just need to stay in there with me, and we will bring in new stuff on the CE show. We are in talks. I am in talks with people, you know. Um, and we will be um, hopefully, hopefully by the end, um, before 2017 is over, before 2000, you know, we, we are bringing better shows, better production to the CE show. We are working. We have to change everything, you know. We need to move on some stuff that doesn't, that is just here wasting space. But we are looking at things to make this show better. And um, like I said, I promise by the end of 2017, hopefully, the CE show gets a, um, a, um, 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 a, um, a, um, a, um, a re remake over or whatever. Rem See y'all later, ladies.